found themselves a small opportunity uh, to find some space for Kushner. Let you find Trex there. I don't know if that was fully through the wall. Yeah, very well could have been at this point, but Russ has found one back, so the plant will at least be kept. Now draws the attention of two. A lot of this retake has now been noted, so BBL going to have to be fighting uphill, but they're using to play, but it's not perfect. But for BBL, they've got to find these players, and they're doing exactly what was needed. Drawn off from the defuse, but yeah. they should be able to have the time, and BBL looking... Now will find themselves an uncontested plant on A site. To see if BBL just commit to some damage, Russ will get overwhelmed, and the weapon retrieved. Hoping that doesn't, pretty big. Yeah, hoping that doesn't equate to a couple more. I mean, Azen's got armor. And, oh, Aim DLL's played this so perfectly. Playing quietly in the shadows. Does get the Punisher was called a mentor, but quickly traded out. So you can see Guild at least trying to find ways back in. It's down to two. That rifle is still in Aslan's hands. I want to see if he can find anything for this. Yes, and yes, he can. he can. Find safe and now looks for more. But the time sign had dwindled. Keep that in the back of your mind. They don't have all the time in the world. A bit of chip damage and they need one of these players to peek and go down quick. And I don't think Guild are going to fall for this. The damage has certainly been achieved in the wild spray. They can get it halfway. He's trying to sit there. No. No, 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 way! That was so close. Well, uh, I mean, ticking the box for... Yushin are under pressure towards the back of sight. He's going to have to respect that, at least for now. Fall away a little bit further. And while that happens, MDLL did catch safe. So now the spike's going to go down to the post-plant from Guild. Got a mentor removed pretty early. Leo in position to trade that one out. So, even right now, a 3v3. The time ticking away. Maybe I'll need to find some way back on here in the crossfire. The main actually works out perfectly, yeah. resulting in two. Kushner responds with one. Again, any less, and it becomes a little more concerning in terms of the finances. Yeah, absolutely ate that flash. Guild gonna stay alive with... He's still out on an island as well. You can see the setup here from BBL. Coldament is in a weird spot as well. This is just a mess if you look at the minimap. It, it I is. Know exactly where uh, now the odds going to kind of reveal everything. Now the seekers do go down at the same time, so kind of both revealing some sort of facts here. But called towards CT as well. Russ ready with the flash. Quick flash pop. Perfect peek off the back. Russ looking sharp today. Looking in control and the follow up as well for the man. Trying to connect on the last bit. Cold Avenger who makes it there in time and. Map it it's it's different every time. Yeah, and it may be your feeling of it's going to come out. This is just looking like Tron right now, but AMDLL still going to expect the play coming out from the tunnel. Safe's going to catch Aslan, but still, AMDLL is just pushed up so close. I don't think he ate the full side of that flash, but still, two angles to clear, and he couldn't do both at the same time. Kushina, though, the readjust is quite nice here. This could be pretty valuable, but safe. What a shot walking into that, leaving it all down to pour up. Alt popped as well. Giving safe a couple more options. And now two players on the spike. It has yeah. to be clean, it can't be. And it's on the attack inside, and Poor is just trying to play his life. Keep a little bit of safety on the site somewhere. As right now it's manic. And those double ops are going to be put in that ult. And no one's looking this way for now, and he does get caught out by Leo. So, not the best to start. Actually, kills come back. There we go. That's uh, well, just like that. A guild is. Well, those double ops are still out, but the problem is they've lost one now. Kushner's gone down, and Mosh has now shown that his presence is also going to be towards Tube, so he has to hit a bit of a move on the back of this, otherwise... Oh, Both trap wise dealt with. Yeah, I, there's not much safety for him, and he knows it. Yeah, he was surrounded. There's no way out, really, for Pora there. He tried as best he can to stay alive, but... Beware. Slam, and aim DLL a position now. So don't think it's all for nothing but light armor, maybe missing some odds and ends. And actually, a bit of a trade-out to begin with. One for one trade goes both sides, and I still has to hold this down. Two players trying to peek him on this, and uh, the loss on the side's a problem as well. The map's becoming to open up for Guild. They have so much access, and the three players for BBL are kind of back to the wall here. They've lost out on Pora, so that's eyes removed from the rest of the map. And actually, Marge's going to try and explore a little, see if he can find some of that information they've lost. And Kushina, exactly oh. the guillotine not looking as sharp, and now the position has been found. Yeah, that is a beautiful... Oh, initially safe. A little oh. bit of a miscalculation on the dash, but access to sight here, and Pora could be the decoy that BBL need on the way in, and it works perfectly. Oh. Puts Russ in an awkward position. Yeah, That's nowhere to run through. and nowhere to yeah. hide. This is great from BBL, just swarming through the map. None of these angles feel comfortable to play. Now, Trent actually gets a freebie on that for the follow-up. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. He got another? 
No shot, and now it's still down on Trex. Can he do any more damage? He finds another individual fight, but Aslan holds his. He started to lean towards the site quite heavily. They should have a fair amount of control, but Pora, look at this positioning. The no regress is perfect, and Pora is just delivering mayhem. And he still wants to go further, but Leo quells that sort of threat. But now position noted, vulnerable. Kushin are going to follow up on what Pora starts. Save time for safe. Gonna pop himself away from the action. Should be no secrecy to this, really. Just that war between uh, and the spam. It pays off. Trek's gonna get away with it. Coming on through, finding Mudge. That's that's. It's a freebie. And where's where's Russ just got that from? I don't think they can even see these players half the time. They're just spamming on in. And then look at what's remaining. Aim DLL and Kushina. That's it. That's all they've got left. And maybe it could be enough. A one v three. Greatness beckoning for the man, and he's answering the call. Flashed up and blind, he's desperate to get away from them. But they close in, they take him down. Seekers and the Aldron to deal with another blind kill from Trex. Oh. <sighs> he's got some fortune on his side. You don't often get to see that sort of thing happen. Kushina has made it towards the site, so they've, they've, they're fighting tooth and nail for this, but there's so, so many targets to deal with, so many different players, and Aslan, good for two. Has to be good for the ace, though. 70 HP in a dream is all he's got at this point. You're safe Spike is down. the operator. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right, and there it is. They do. And Russ finding that timing window again. Spots one just on the cusp, but gets a little worried by Gore, but his buddies have his back. And it's looking like 12 is about to be lit up on the scoreboard as Fushina gets caught. This is... Looking a little one-dimensional from BBL. BBL so often on a site, there's just, there's no attempt of BBL to address any other part of the map. Like, yeah, sure enough, you might get away with a couple of rounds just forcing A. I mean, here, sure. round 19, it's it's match point for, sorry, map point for Guild. Which will show that oh, they're around, huge. but Leo, big tags already being dished out and does get caught off though. You should have got to quickly try and close that gap for Russell on the trade out. More vision found and Drex again. The man doesn't have to truly see them. He just gets the outline and it's more than enough. But a 3v2. Finally an advantage for BBL in one of these rounds, but look at Cordamenta. Oh, Mike, they have no idea that he could be this close by no means. And I on the other exactly. side, all you got to do is buy time if you're safe. He does more than that. He gets two. Two back to back. And here comes the closing of the gap called the Menta. It's going to put him in the grave. What? As to greet BBL oh. on a long here and a nice oh. opener there from Leah. That's where you want to see in round one. The headhunter finds his target. I see a little bit of damage done on the backside. You see Aslan's tagged up as well. Safe. Can he find anything from this spot? No. That's no, a gravity well. No follow up either here. So Leo's got to be really careful. Yeah, Leo's pinched and he's blinded. He's been taken down. BBL with the perfect crunch in response, clearing out long so perfectly. But a quick consideration of the flank, and rightly so. You can already see that Russ is so quick to this. Super fast to get around without frenzy. Going to check towards long, but he's just. And whether or not he's really just going to opt to try and find any. Okay, well, no. Very problematic. Russ. Okay, well, the trade is good, though. Trade's good. You'll take that every day of the week. You'll be fine with that trade. Now, the problem is, though, can it get any more on the way through? No. For now, Cold is just going to be called on. Like, hey, buddy, can't really help you on the side to do as much as you can. He gets splashed, tries to do a bit of damage, but actually gets punished. Look at this pressure from BBL. is mad, but instantly the response... <laughs> oh, Kushina is... This well, timing unlucky. is done for. Well, is it? Is that unlucky? Okay. It's a tag. It's it's a frag and a tag, so it ain't gonna be huge. You're right, two still left. We put into play, there's one. And look at the HP on MDLL. Oh, damaged <laughs> earlier. Caught on the way down. We're back to a 2v3 now. And look at Russ, the positioning. He played it well. He kind of came through garage. He loved it out, but the nerves look to get the best oh. of him. And Aslan shows no nerves at all. The man's got ice in the veins, but no that. HP to play with. But damn. Now, only noting the jet out of that pack of players, there are three around that corner, and Aslan's already punished Russ. Called him into feeling far more isolated than he likes. You can see how far away the rest of his teammates are, and actually... Oh my word, this is just getting weird and wonderful. How is this happening? BBL finding quick... I mean, no pressure at all. I mean, it's looking like they're just committed to Guild. Are able to structure some of these rounds. Mm. Don't let somebody just on the defense, right? <laughs> You know, gifted a freebie. Cold Dementor. Look who's closing no in. Cold Dementor with a judge. Oh, what? Oh, she just clears him. 
So simple for him, apparently. 25 seconds now. The clock was a big enemy in this, but they've waited out the time wonderfully, eating the flashes direct, so he can't now peek the corner. But Ross was the next layer to this flank. Still alive and still a problem. They just have to buy time here. Start to stand their ground. And Leo and Safe doing that to perfection in the end. It got... Is he sick on this? Big info found. No idea. They are none the wiser. And actually, he just needs to fall away from that now. That's impact done, and a big picture now painted. Rex. But Yushina is still safe to try and stay here as long as he can. There's already players pushing forward. He's done for. He's absolutely cooked. And actually, a swift little pickup from Leo. What a little bit of a steal, like a thief in the night. Picks up a frag and dips away. Going to keep it at least an even. That's like on site right now. Ooh, and the flash should give away that they're all tucked towards the CT side of things. So Cold and Mentor should be on red alert. They press back corner, but didn't seem all too aware. Leo was locked and loaded. Now Ross can play it back to the time. Got to check towards health because Thor is still waiting. No way, Leo. Leo. There's a reason that this man impressed me on this map. It always made him look so comfortable and on the money. And you're seeing... Has to respect it, that's a lot of you. What? Bora! Back to back, baby. This guy is an animal when it comes down to it. But the site is still under BBL's control. They're going to at least be able to get that spike planted. I don't think anyone can deny that for now. And now the problem is, you got a judge in the retake here. Safe. Way ahead of the curve there. Wants to get something done with the blade storm. Tracks now, last man standing. Kushina. <laughs> Sharp, swift headshot. Russ might actually catch poor right here. Again, the awareness. Spike planted. And this is where the weapon should come through, right? This is... Uh, unless Golden Mentor's the one to find a bit of something off the back of it, but there we go. More time being added to the mix, but safe still connects towards Kushina. Aimed a little quick on the trade, and now here comes the take. Aslan forced to fight out from Garage, and it's down to two. Aimed still one of them, though, and still on guard duty. Sprays him wildly, and doesn't get what he wants. They're gonna force the ult out again. And, and this is... This is appalling. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the hunters... Right. Both trying to get a little bit more aggressive, trying to get... Oh, no way! <gasps> and Kushin is still alive. He stands, he weathers the storm somehow through the damage. Chip damage comes in, 18 HP. Though, and we know that's been a common Spike element planted. and factor for guild. We know that Cold Adventure and Russ love playing this way, and now two players are there on the other side to address it. Double stack towards Sua, but it's a quick killing of Bora. Now, there is one more, and they didn't expect that. That's the difference here, but Trek's finding so much success working back in through CT. He's even noted the player in towards Sua. He might know where both these players are. And Cold Adventure, have you been seen? Have you been found? Kushina looks like he knows what is up, but he misses a quick shot. Oh, brilliant play from BBL in the end, but under the gun again. God, <laughs> safe. Constantly being just held back. Trex again. The there with the Hunter's Fury. Actually gets a vessel Ooh, back in the ground well. That could be huge. That, that, oh, I thought that could have been a double. It still could be. Trex can find two. And Russ then going to try and fill the gap. Play in towards that and the setup. It was just too inviting for BBL. They desperately wanted to play up long, but you could see the trap was set. Oh, yeah, suddenly. Guys, there's a lot of people behind us. Please turn around. I don't want to die. And yeah, good response for damage on either side. It is favorable for now towards guild, at least numbers-wise. Player standing. Uh, I couldn't get away. I thought... There's already progress towards the side itself. First challenge succeeds. Could do with more, though. What's the second? And it's Trex's go of things. So guild... Well, Russ is out of the equation quickly. Kushina with first contact, gonna be happy enough with that. They could probably filter the weapon away, but oh, the punish on the follow-up too. Oh. I mean, a brilliant read as well. Uh, they've actually got two players and the operation of Okay, okay. <gasps> get out, get out. Where's the next person? Where's the next person? Oh, I thought Leo was gonna have AMDLL just clean then. Trex does eventually get there as almost the second player to that. As Safe put his life on the line, he was fully ready to just try and live as long as he can, but do they find any ability to clear Safe here? And Trex in both complementary positions, one teeing up the other, and now Pora called upon. You need some of that magic dig deep this time, Pora. And one. that's a bit of this frag and find it fast as Trex just slips away into the night. He's gonna play Trex. the time and Pora's gonna lose the eyesight on this. Trex is just keeping compose. He's gonna play to that audio cue. Peeks out just ahead. Played. And Trex, this thing. I see. Safe again. Happy to throw his life on the line here. Damage comes through. Actually, the kills go in favor of BBL here, but Trex. Oh, Trex. This god, this guy is absolutely on the money. MDLL trying to just spray down, expecting that next player to come through. Pora with the freest kill of his life, and now it's all down to Leo. A one v two. And the spike, he wants that down. He wants at least the clock in his favor. But Pora's closing in, and oh, just about dips away. Now seen, now revealed. 
nowhere feels safe, but he finds a 1v1. And now Leo, how has he gotten this far? Dips away, but... Oh, the timing on the swing. He's trying to get someone to walk into Kushina, but... Oh, it's not gone well. Broke off the trap. This okay. could be deadly here. Leo's here to guard Leo's him. watching. What? Leo's what? watching. He's watching. Locked and loaded. No shot. And they remove. Currently put two players into this, at least towards the side itself. And that's going to allow Aslan a little bit of room to work. Yes, yeah, safe on the site, but oh, Aslan. Gorgeous shot towards Garage, but you've still got a 4v3. The weapons are subpar coming in from BBL, though. And Aim DLL going to get punished for it. Safe up and over, try to get a quick knife through. It's Ooh. not what he wants. It's Whiffy, but he's got Trex by his side. So all is forgiven as Paul does what he can on the way down, but it's just one player standing in a 1v2. Can he do anything with this? Oh, he saved the day for BBL. It looks like two players uh, are pretty close to this one being Aim DLL, but there's a lot of utility, so we know there's going to be at least that KJ close enough by, and you're going to have Q filling the gap as well and safe <laughs> where you off <laughs> potentially make something work oh maybe not now that's that gifted two things that, uh, are willing to throw what's necessary at some of these rounds i don't know if the the time was just a little bit possibility kushan anti gonna get punished here with the updraft safe so far ahead of where they expected Quick smoke towards CT, and he wants to keep this space safe. He wants to make sure that plant comes in, as Guild will have five in the post. Plant Poor is not being subtle with this. It should be Leo winning that fight every day of the week. So much information, and there's the divide. There's the Seekers. It's all being thrown into this. If yeah, people even have a real shot to get back in here. Crossfire looks deadly, Lauren. It certainly does, and we'll see if there's any sort of fight going back in from BBL. We're down to just two now. Aim DLL and Aslan, the last two to try and make a go of this. And you're seeing it now, just Aslan, brave as you like, tries to crest the corner and Coldermen.